Huawei's chairman took to the stage Monday. It was the company's first response to US moves to cut it off from global chip supplies. Guo Ping made no attempt to downplay the impact. Our business will inevitably be massively impacted, but this past year of practice has given us a thick skin. We are confident that we can find a solution soon. Guo says survival is now the firm's watchword. The handset and telecom gear maker says it's doing all it can to find a workaround. It's already massively ramped up research and development spending. Guo's comments come after Washington said it would require licenses for sales to Huawei of chips made abroad but with US technology. The company has been on a US blacklist for over a year over allegations it colludes with Chinese spies, charges the firm strongly denies. Company Vice President of International Media Joe Kelly sees commercial motives behind the US policy. The US is leveraging its own technological strengths in an attempt to crush companies outside its own borders. This will only serve to undermine the trust that international companies place in US technology and US supply chains. Ultimately, we believe this will harm US interests. Huawei says it spent $18.7 billion last year buying from US suppliers and would continue to buy from them if allowed. None of that is enough to mollify China hawks in the Trump administration.